The rules are also strict if you're looking to rent a place in our high country. Our Mountain Newsroom reporter Jamie Leary joins us live from Frisco tonight. And Jamie, you've learned you could also face a fine if you break the rules. Absolutely. Failure to comply with the latest public health order here in Summit County could land you a fine of up to $5,000 and 18 months in jail. The sheriff says it would have to be an egregious, repetitive violation to wind up in that position. But still, COVID cases here remain high and the rules are tight so they don't go any higher. Not following those rules, it's not worth more restrictions. I mean, the fines make sense. If you're breaking the law, you should be fine for breaking the law. It's easy to break if you don't know all the rules. The latest public health order from Summit County has a few, even for visitors. For a short-term lodging capacity, 10 people or less from only two households. Trevor is part of a group of 10 from Pennsylvania, all staying together in an Airbnb near Keystone. So you have probably more than two different households with you. They weren't aware you can't have more than two, but they knew in general rules here are tight. We wear masks everywhere and yeah. We don't really talk to too many people. It's tighter for locals. No more than six people inside from no more than two households. The reason for the difference? Our high, 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 very high case numbers among our residents. Our own residents are going to multiple different types of gatherings of all different sizes. The likelihood anyone would face a fine is low. Of the 455 calls to public health between March and October, there were only 49 warnings given. Public health wants residents to be responsible for themselves with the new orders. We really felt strongly that this was a strategic measure that we could take to really hone in on what we're actually seeing among our resident population. For visitors like Trevor, the rise in cases here and new restrictions. I mean, obviously it didn't deter you. Why not? I don't know. I feel like I'm young and I mean, even if I did get sick, I would just quarantine. So while big fines and jail time for individuals aren't likely, the sheriff did tell me today that he has a meeting with public health tomorrow to discuss enforcement strategies moving forward. Live in Frisco, Jamie Leary, CBS4 Mountain Newsroom. Well,